Pat Crack and MTG here, and I'm back with some Modern Horizons 3. Probably some of the last Modern Horizons 3 I'm going to get my hands on. I keep saying that, and then I keep buying more. What are you going to do? I do love this set. Straight up addicted to it. And we are 12 subscribers away from giving this away to one lucky subscriber. So let's get there and send this out. And we are going to up the giveaway when we get to 400 one more time and give away something bigger than a collector's pack. All right, so without further ado, let's get into this Modern Horizon 3 pre-release kit. Come on. Oh, let's move to this to the side. We'll talk about this a little later, of course. So what's everybody been up to? I've been playing a little bit more Commander Rare normally than normal, I should say. Okay, let's get in here. Uh, definitely enjoying Commander. I'm probably going to be doing some more Commander videos here coming soon. All right. Oh, we got the black and yellow dice. What did we get for our promo? Hopefully we got something spicy. Let's have a look here. Oh. Oh, nice. Flare of Malice. That's not too bad. We'll take that. I will definitely take that. Is there more than one? Oh, yeah. There's a code in here you guys can have. That's right. Can't forget that. Our Flare of Malice. And there's your code. Hopefully that's on screen long enough for somebody to get it. And our uh, foil flare of malice, not too bad. All right. Six delicious packs of Modern Horizons 3. This is not going to be an overly long video. But uh, take our little dessert of Modern Horizons 3 while we can. Ooh, did I see something? All right, let's just wait. Probably just a token. All right, well, we definitely... Uh, don't need to be held up on the commons on this, because everybody knows them. There are a few good uncommons and commons for sure in this set, without a doubt. This is seeing some play in uh, the Ags deck, as it used to be called, or the Affinity deck, Affinity for Artifact deck, as it is now. And our uncommon, four uncommons in that pack. We got a rare, oh nice, medallion, we'll take it. And our rare. Oh, I don't believe I got the black uh, land out of this set, so I'm happy to have that. And our foil common. Not too shabby. And our token. Zombie Snake Druid. Nice. <laughs> Alright, just going to make sure everything's on camera. Alright, we're good. On to pack number five. And we got an art card in this one. What do we got? Oh, wing it, love it. Faithful Watchdog. Oh, Consign to Memory. It's a card I need more of. A very good uncommon for sure. I will definitely take it. And our flip card. Nope, that's not a flip card. My mistake. Deep Analysis. And our rare. Oh, Flare Denial. Sweet. So we got two flares out of this already. Of course, including our promo. And our foil. And our Eldrazi land. See Kozilak there in the background. And there's Tamio. Be sweet to pull one of her. Alright. On to pack number three. Or four. Get through these uncommons like to see one more cool uncommon. Urza's Cave or something like that would be nice. I would like that. Last uncommon. Rare. Oh, Womp Womp. Oh, foil rare. Oh, nice Devourer of Destiny foil. Sweet! I'll be trading that out for a non-foil one in my Tron deck. For sure. We'll take it. Double rare pack. And our foil land. Guess we can put this over here. Show it off a little bit longer. Foil land. And just a promotional card. Alright, three packs left. Come on. Yeah. Power of Destiny, that's pretty cool. 
in foil. Especially where I do run that card, it is seeing play in all the Tron decks because it is just very good at setting up your top card. Normally you're looking for that land, but sometimes you're looking for a threat. Ugin's Labyrinth being the land you're usually looking for. Because you can uh, exile the Devourer of Destiny to the Ugin's Labyrinth. Ah, Bloodstained Mire. I swear I pulled so many Bloodstained Mires out of this set. Feels like by far the most common land that I hit. Oh, rare. And our foil. And our Aldrazi Swan, our spawn token. Foil, oh, foil. And token. All right, two left. So used to saying Aldrazi Scion. All right. This set, I, I really love it. I find it way too expensive like everybody else, but it is by far my favorite set to open with Otadote, or at least right now. Our rare. Oh, nice. Jet Medallion in the full art. That's cool art. Such cool art. Love that. And we'll definitely take a full art. And we got a Mythic? Okay. We got a Mythic. What do we got? What do we got? Ah, oh, not the mythic I was hoping for, for sure, but we'll definitely take it. And I love that jet medallion. That is awesome. And a foil in common. Oh, there's our mythic. Our one mythic, our uh, mythic that we're going to get in this. Can't really see it, though, so let's move it down a little bit. It's not exactly on camera. And our foil. And our token, which is pretty cool. Or our art card, I should say. All right, last pack. Not that I can say that this has been bad, for sure. Can we get one more good hit? Huh. Banned right out the gate in Popper. Didn't even stand a chance. Oh, we got our Ursus Cave. Sweet. Ask and you shall receive. Nice. Another one. Sink into Stupor. Very good uncommon. Oh, we got another mythic. Oh, okay. This is from the uh, the commander slot. At least we got two mythics out of it. Nothing wrong with that. It's weird that it was in between. Oh, that's because that's the uh, the retro card, if you will. The reprint. Oh, we did get another mythic. Woohoo! Okay. What do we got? Oh, nice! Straight up, Kozilak. We will take it. All right, that's what we're looking for. I do love me some Aldrazi. Just a foil uncommon. All right, that was pretty good. I will definitely take it. Just land. Okay. So, on to our giveaway, if I can find it. It's buried under some stuff over here now. So as you guys know, you get the sets of cards in fives and you pick one of the cards to vote for that you would like to receive in the giveaway. This was last week's. This was the previous week's, I do believe. They might be not quite in the right order. And this was the start of the month, if I do recall correctly. I know that Galta is definitely getting some votes, and so is uh, Yargle. And we, like I said before, we are only 12 subscribers away from giving this away to one lucky subscriber. So let's get up there. And like I was saying before, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to step it up a notch for the 400 sub giveaway. So let's get there and uh, in our next video, I'll announce what we're going to give away in that. All right. Please like, subscribe, hit that bell. Later.